Yeah, man, you know what it is. Nump Trump, the gorilla, you know, Pope, and you watch the PhilippineNews.com. Mabuha. Bruno looked great. He uh, trained really, really hard. He is completely focused and ready and hungry for, for this fight tomorrow. He's, uh, just ready to go. Yeah, you know, I think um, after Bruno's last fight, um, it, was, it was a good chance to kind of get go back get back to the drawing board, kind of adjust his style a little bit. He went down and was sparring with uh, Brian Valoria, getting him ready for, um, for his big win over Tyson Marquez. So I think he gained a lot of experience with that. And, um, you know, I just think, like, I think he learned a lot. I think he became a professional in his last fight, and, uh, and he's, he's ready to show it now. Uh, very good, very focused. He's very excited to have the opportunity to fight, you know, again before the end of the year. Yeah, lots of improvements since the last fight against Bill Noe. We lost the decision, but it was a great learning experience for him. You know, he went from four rounds right to eight rounds, and uh, that was a big challenge. And, you know, I, I feel that that night was. Even though we didn't come off with the uh, victory, it was a learning experience where Bruno became, he went from pro boxer to professional fighter and understands what all that entails. So now it's much more focused. I'm very comfortable. He's been looking great in sparring. You know, he spars very top caliber guys up, up in our area, the Bay Area. And he was also, he was the chief spar partner for uh, Brian Valoria for his fight against Hernan. Marquez. So, I mean, he's been getting great work and he's totally ready to, to do this.